Today we're going to do a review and a how-to on uh, Harbor Freight's Pittsburgh Automotive Mini Tire Changer, item number 61179. We're going to change a lawnmower tire. Well, we're going to put a tube in it. First, you got to let the air out of the tire. Once you get the air out of the tire, you can set the wheel and tire on the tire changer. I always use both of the plastic spacers that it comes with, but your tire may be different or your wheel may be different, so you might not use them. After you put the spacers on, you thread this nut down. And then to use the bead breaker, Put it on like this, get the edge of the bead breaker right underneath the rim, and then you can just push down. You might have to work your way around, or it might, the bead might break right away. Once you do one side, flip the wheel and tire over, and do the other. That's all there is to it to break the bead. Now we'll take the tire off the wheel. I like to spray it down with a little bit of soapy water. Makes the tire slip off the rim a little bit easier. Use this next. You just pop it under the bead of the tire, pull it up, and then spin it. You have to make sure this nut is tight though, or the whole wheel will just spin. Once you do one side, you can lift it up. Do the same thing for the other side. tires off. Now we're going to put a tube in it. Make sure when you take your tire off, rub your hand on the inside of it. Make sure there's no nails or thorns sticking through it. As soon as you put your tube in, it's going to pop it if there is. Spray it down with some soapy water. I like to do it with the valve stem up on the wheel. And I also need to cut this off.
Okay, now I get one side of the tire on the wheel. I like to use a tire iron or a screwdriver just to get this side on. It's a little bit easier. After it's on, you can put your tube inside your tire. I like to spray it down with soapy water also. First thing I do is I feed the valve stem up through the hole in the wheel. And I like to put my valve stem tool where the cap would go to hold the valve stem from pulling out of the wheel. Once you get the valve stem in, you can kind of pick up on the tire, push the tube all the way around the wheel. Okay, once you have the tube inside of there, now you can use this tool that comes with the tire changer. You slip it in between the wheel and the bead of the tire. You push down on the tire and work it around. Just be careful not to grab a hold of your tube. Once that side of the bead's on, I like to take it off, put the air in. You have to watch when you put the air in it. If you're not holding on to the valve stem, it'll suck the valve stem right into the wheel. That's all there is to it. The tire changer works good for small lawnmower tires, but four wheeler tires, not so good. You can't really break the bead with the bead breaker. I welded on this two inch square tubing uh, to put in a receiver of a vehicle. Makes it a little more stable when you're changing the tire. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.